Hello. Can you introduce yourself to me, please? Um, my name is Nguyen Khai Hoan, and uh, I am 14 years, and I'm currently studying in secondary school. Uh, his name is Lung Pei Ming School. Okay, very nice. So, we're going to start part one of the test, and we're going to be talking about gender roles. So, uh, what characteristics do you think men should have? Um, personally, I I am a man, so I know like quite a lot about it, and uh, I think that men should be like brave, mm -hmm. and uh, like normally men is a breadwinner of the family, mm -hmm. so that they always have to face the problem and the uh, like economic problems, mm -hmm. like particularly. And so that they always need to be brave and uh, be the like the shoulders for their family to cry out. Okay. I think so. Nice. Uh, what about women? What do you think women should do in society? In society, women has make, like an important role. I think that in the society, women can do a lot of things, and they have some really like really beautiful characteristic. For example, like the. Uh, but they are they are really gentle, kind, like that, and I believe that they should always be like a average of like the middle of angry and calm. I think like that. Okay, interesting. Um, have you ever been surprised by how someone behaves for their gender? Like, have you met a woman who does not behave like a woman, or a man who doesn't behave like a man? Yeah, I sometimes see those kind of people. Mm -hmm. Like for example, uh, like in my family, is my mom, mm -hmm. cause she is normally I would say women are really gentle and kind, mm -hmm. but my mom is kind of really angry cause she sometimes I play games or I haven't done the housework. Mm -hmm. She may yell at me and. Uh, she will feel unpleasant about me. Okay, nice. Um, and what can you do in your life to, uh, what do you do in your life to treat men and women the same? Um, I think that in order to treat men and women in a similar way, we should like always be uh, equal to mm. each gender. Mm. Like for example, you should not have the better like preference on the on men. Like you know, in the past, Vietnamese has a really bad um, thought. It bad thought, and it's like they prefer men to women because they always like some families who born uh, boys, so they would rather like that to them bonds goes. Okay, nice. Uh, we're going to move on to part two of the speaking test now, okay? So, um, just let me read the question to you and then you can start writing. So, uh, describe the relative who had the most influence on you, okay? The most influence. Uh, I'd like you to say who they are, how often you see them, and in what ways they've influenced your behavior. And I want you to tell me about whether or not you think uh, their influence will be helpful to you in your life, okay? So you can start writing now, off you go, you have one minute. Okay, right, if you can stop writing, please. So, uh, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, off you go. Um, 
a relative who like have the most effect on me is you know I have to say is absolutely my uh, sister. Mm. She is about like she is more than five years than five years old mm. than me, and she is living in my hometown in Nghệ An province. And uh, the way she influenced me are in many ways. It's like uh, in the first way she motivate me and give me inspiration for my learning path. For, for example, like um, someday I have a really bad result in the chemistry test so that I feel really bad of myself and uh, after that I contact her on through uh, social media and uh, in that moment she like called me through videos to face call and uh, she gave me she gave me many useful advice advice and uh, some really useful tips in order to get a better score at the next test mm. and uh, in the second way she support me in many phases for example like in the past I used to be very bad at math and I didn't do it really well and she is a, an excellent he's a, an excellent sister that she learned really hard and she got the like some of the gold medal of the um, of her city mm. in the math subjects so that she helped me a lot and like teach me really many nice knowledge mm. And uh, moreover, she also influenced me in the way I live. Okay. This is really important because, like, I already, I, in the past, I have a really bad time that I used to be, I used to be addicted in games. And I don't want to tell about that, but I mean, she got a really good results at school. She's doing well, and she like get on well with everyone around her mm. so I like want to mimic or like follow her uh, lifestyle and I copy her lifestyle a lot which improve my like my life in a positive way okay nice uh, we're going to move on to the final okay uh, just promise me you don't look at this okay we're going to move on to part three now so um, part three is about gender at work. So, um, we talked before about gender roles, what men and women should do. Uh, do you think that men and women uh, are treated equally in Vietnam at work? Do you think of work, men and women are treated the same? Um, I would say both sides. Mm. Uh, like the first side, uh, women should be treated like better than men. Mm or in some companies they are treated equal mm. let me say in the first side mm. is uh, women are treated better than men is um, in my particularly in my uh, father's company like the um, deputy CEO of the company mm. like got a prefer preference to women because yeah, like you know, normally women would be a weaker side mm, compared to men, mm. so that like he uh, want to give women some benefits when working, and if uh, women, if some girls had an interview with him, mm. he would take it easier rather than men. Mm. And the other side is treated equally. I think about 30% of companies in Vietnam would treat like that because each place is each, everywhere, everything needs equal treat uh, and is to say in gender so that I think treat each gender equally would be a benefit for the company and for each of the members in the company mm -hmm. so that they will not be envious of the other individuals Okay. Do you think there are any jobs that women are good at that men are not good at? Um, personally, I would say yes, there are some jobs 
that women can do better than men. Mm. Like for example, most of the in uh, housework or mm. at, in the family, women would be the main cook for the family. So that if I had to say, women would be better at men in chef in cooking. Okay. Okay. And uh, but uh, in reality. Many famous chefs like Gordon Ramsay or some of them are men, but uh, in general, women would be better men better than men in cooking. Mm. What about stuff that men are better at than women? Do you think there's anything that men do better than women? Yeah, definitely. Like what? Um, like some things require logic or mm. math. I think men would be better at that because they develop a Hygiene logic and as some research and evidence on the internet that I have uh, I have found in the past uh, that men's got a I, I would not say to everyone but in general men got a higher IQ than women mm -hmm. so that I think men would do better at like things required maths or logic okay. and moreover I think men's got a better physics and uh, so they got like stronger and more muscle has more muscle okay. in general so, so that some building jobs required like um, human labor mm -hmm. I think men's would be better Okay, uh, there's one final question I'm going to ask you here, which is uh, in Western countries, they want to have uh, women join the army at the at the front with the men. Do you think this is a good idea? Mm, that's kind of interesting, mm. but I think somehow, in my opinion, as a Oriental like living country, mm. I think that would not be a good idea. Cause I think that women's is a as I mentioned, that women is a weaker side, and they does not like want to be strong as men, because mm. the uh, beautiful of the women based on their face, not their body. Mm. Uh, I mean, their body, but not like muscular like that. So, and moreover, the army requires like going to wars mm. or training really hard. So that I think uh, it requires some. Really, patience and uh, patience characteristic gender and strong one, so that I think men will be like in a better like positions in the, that situation. Okay, very nice. Uh, that concludes the end of the test. Well done, Mr. Thank you.